Maybe we should take Good morning guys Yes, I am in Malaysia indeed I am in Kuala Lumpur And I'm here by myself As you can see there's no cars in here This is a solo travel It was a trip that was just that just had to happen um, I had to leave Vietnam for visa reasons but anyways um, yeah I'm only gonna be here for hopefully not more than two weeks fingers crossed but yeah I'm excited to be here I'm in KL I'm gonna be in KL for a couple days and then I'm gonna go see some family because I do have family here in Malaysia so that's really exciting but yeah it's our first full day here it's super sunny I came in last night as you guys saw I mean, it's very, it's a nice hotel, it looks very cute. And now I'm gonna head out, first things first on the list is Sephora. I need to go makeup shopping. Guys, to find my, my makeup products for like my skin tone in Vietnam is impossible. So when I knew I was coming to Malaysia, I was more excited to go like for makeup shopping more than anything else so we're heading to sephora first the hotel i'm out i'm living at is in chinatown so very very nice location so i'm gonna head to sephora first then circle back to this area to get to explore chinatown and see what kale has to offer i'm super excited to be here i wish carson was here but unfortunately he isn't but yeah i'm super excited i hope you guys are excited to explore malaysia with me it's my very first time here so you know that new country feeling it feels really nice so yeah i'm excited let's go this is the fit shorts top that's what we're doing today and yeah i don't know if i should take a taxi or if i should take the train i did take the train from the airport down here yesterday so i'll figure out the trains maybe i'll do the trains or i don't know i'll figure it out but well, i'm excited let's go <laughs> from Sephora I dropped my things in my hotel room and now I am going to explore I'm so excited now we're gonna walk around Chinatown see what's here it's a nice day it's drizzling a little bit I hope it doesn't rain but yeah let's walk around and see what we can find in the streets of Kale for a few and I'm hungry it's currently two and I didn't eat breakfast today I haven't eaten anything I'm trying to find a good light anyways so I'm in Chinatown and I just saw this stand here and if it looks good isn't this like alley so fingers crossed I don't get food poisoning or anything but I ordered some fried rice with um, what's it called now with seafood yeah Last night when I got to the hotel, I ordered nasi lemak. It's the um, national dish for Malaysia. That's what I've been to. It was really good. I had it already last night, so I wanted to try something else today. But it was so good. 10 out of 10. 100 percent. I love it. I'm definitely gonna have it again. But yeah, I'm gonna eat, get some more energy, and then we're gonna go out and still explore. The weather is still kind of a little drizzly, but it's not rainy, so that's good. But yeah, I'm excited. Day one, full day in Kuala Lumpur. I'm super excited. Wow. All right, guys, food is here. Let's eat. I'm so excited. It looks so good. Do that. Wow. <clears throat> oh yeah. Ooh. Oh my god, this is so 
good. Definitely go back there to eat. Okay, now I'm just gonna walk around some more. I really have no plans. I'm just walking around, checking in the sights. So that's what we're doing. Playing in the same bed. I need a kickstart just to change this. I don't want to submit it on the basics, but it's keeping me feeling so amazing. Goblin, stretch, brush my hair, always looking like a mess. Oh, and me, I could go and do the rest. Give it a little more fit, I'll be set. And I hope that you don't miss it as I stay that now when I'm stuck in my bed Day and night, never feeling my best, I know, oh well But this time will not be the same again It's day and night, and I'm stuck in my bed Day and night, and I'm stuck in my bed Hey guys, welcome to day two in KL. It's actually 2 o'clock guys. It's 2 p.m. in the afternoon. I've been inside just all day Can you hear my voice? I sound very nasally. I got a cold Yesterday, so I'm very stuffy Anyways, I've just been resting Doing some work on my computer, but I figured it's a very beautiful day. I'm on vacation. I should go outside So today I don't really have much to do because I'm gonna be leaving here tomorrow And I'm gonna go over to my brothers and then I'm gonna come back to, K, uh, to KL again and when I come back I'm gonna do more touristy stuff so I don't want to cramp so much into like my time here now but anyway so today I'm gonna go to KL Tower I'm gonna try and see if I can get tickets to go into like the observation deck and look at the views from up there and just really walk around I just went on TikTok to just find things around my area like where the hotel is I'm at that I can do and that's what I'm gonna do I don't want really I don't really want to go out of my way because when I come back from my brothers back to kale that's when i'm gonna go out of my way to do all the other things i want to do but yeah i just wanted to let you guys know what we are doing i'm super excited this is the fit tank top shorts it's hot you know i don't i can't be asked and um yeah i'm super excited so let's go Twin Towers. I have a very distinctive memory of the Twin Towers. The first time I ever saw it was in a James Bond movie, Sean Connery. And it's actually my memory because I remember it was my dad that bought the James Bond 
movie. Honestly, it was my dad that introduced me personally to any James Bond movie at all. That's why James Bond series is very dear to me because it was my dad that introduced me to James Bond movies. And I vividly remember the Sean Connery one at this Twin Tower. And every time I think of Twin Tower, I think I, the memory I have is me watching that movie with my dad. So yeah, it's so cool. Oh my god, I'm gonna go there tonight around the area with my friend um, Yeah, he's gonna take me around that area because I have a friend that lives here in Malaysia So yeah, he's gonna take me around that area double that'll be for later tonight, but it's it's a stunning structure like look at that Just look at that Why is my camera not focused? Just, it's insane Wow Crazy. deck and it cost $14 equivalent and it's 60, 60 ringgit and I did online conversion and it was about 14 US dollars to come up here there is a sky deck so with the sky deck it's just like open air and with the observation you have the the windows and the bars right um, I don't know why I didn't want it the sky deck was over a hundred ringgit so I was like it's still gonna be the same views It's a paranormal view 360 so so that's an option but yeah I'm gonna start heading down now. There's really nothing, I mean, besides the views, which is a stunning, like a stunning view. There's really nothing much. It's, as you can see, it's like a construction site, basically. So there's no cafes or any shops to just sit down. And I've walked. So I'm going to start heading down now. And um, you can actually see, not my hotel, but one of the towers that you can see from my hotel. I think some buildings are covering my hotel where I'm at. But anyways, I'm gonna start heading down now and I'm gonna go to an area um, with really cool arts on the wall, murals and nice cafes. I check TikTok. TikTok is my search for everything when I'm traveling. I go to TikTok, I just type what I want and videos pop up. So I'm gonna head there from here and I go. This is really, really cool. And I think, cause my sister is gonna come, my sister, she's gonna come join me in a couple days. We're gonna do this again, nighttime view, but we're gonna look from the Twin Towers instead. I can't wait to see, the view during the day is stunning. I can't wait to see what it looks like at night. Honestly, Kale is really, really beautiful. It's a stunning city, wow. So, yeah, I mean, I didn't have any expectations, but yeah, this is this is amazing. So yeah, I'm gonna start heading down now, and I'm gonna head to the next location. So, let's go. Look at me, solo traveling. <laughs> One last goodbye to the view.
Oh my god guys, I'm so tired. I've walked a lot today by see her. Anyways, I am back in the room now and I'm just gonna rest for a bit. Uh, my friend should be here in maybe an hour or an hour 30 minutes. And we are gonna go out to around the Twin Towers and I will bring you guys along. I will show you guys what we get up to while we're there. But yeah, it's been a very productive day of sightseeing and walking around. I also stopped by the pharmacy and got some medicine because yeah, the stuffy nose is making me feel a little bit sick. So I bought some like pain relief meds or whatnot. But yeah, I'm just gonna relax now and I will catch you guys very shortly. guys a different location and honestly I think it's been about almost a week since the last time you guys saw me because I went over to my brothers and I saw my nephews and I'm back in Kale with my sister she's somewhere there and then my nephews are also in town because my brother and my nephews live outside of Kale City so they came in town as well but they're in a different hotel we'll see them later today and yeah we are going we're back to exploring back to being tourists today we're going to check out battle caves I'm so excited to not excited to climb the steps but excited to see the big Buddha and to see the monkeys as well but yeah we're ready this is the fit tank top this is tank. the fit Ooh. my annoying little sister behind me and yeah that is what we are doing today and I wanted to catch you guys up so Let's go! So we made it to the Batu Cave entry we didn't have to pay to enter so far and now we are going to walk around look at the monkeys up there anyways gonna walk around now and explore the temple We made 
to the very top. That was another extra stairs inside the cave. But yeah, it's so pretty, guys. And like lots of monkeys up there. But yeah, it's really, really beautiful. Like, wow, look at that. It's insane. Yeah, we are going to. I'm sweating. Oh, wait, I'm so dark. Wait, let me light brighten up the eyes. Okay. We're going to head back down now, find a cold beverage to drink. No. <laughs> Find a cold beverage to drink and then oh my god look at how sweaty I am uh, and try to uh, cool down so yeah let's head back down let's head Oh, my friends don't care about everything as long as you got a story to bring. We'll take you along, take you along, take you along to some other places. We try towards the other horizon, maybe to spend a couple hundred till we. Hey guys, I am still in Malaysia. Yeah, anyways, that's my sister there. We are in the city of Melaka, I think that's how it's pronounced, and we're just here for two nights. Um, and we're just gonna do a little bit of sightseeing. We just arrived like maybe 20 minutes ago. We're very hungry, neither of us have eaten today. It's currently past four, so we're just gonna walk around the hotel where we asked to see if we can find food. I don't plan to do any like sightseeing until like tomorrow when I have a full day of doing that. But yeah, that is what we are getting up to today and I wanted to let you guys know where I'm at. So, let's go. Recklessly, I may just write a letter home to say goodbye to everyone and Come and see the world in a different light and capture Everyone else, everyone else will think that 
that is weird So maybe I might start keeping it clean And bear with the whole unusual feeling I'll be alright, we'll be alright We'll be alright for two or three days But after all the conversations have died out I'll play the music from the beginning And then we all just see it again then Good morning. It is our first full day here in Malacca and we are going to start exploring the city. Um, first stop, we're going to go to the Dutch Dutch Street. It's very near our hotel here. And then we're just going to bum around town, see what's there. And I'm very excited. It's a very beautiful blue skies day. And yeah, I wanted to introduce the vlog and let you guys know what is going on. So yeah, super excited. Just wearing a really nice dress and um, yeah, let's go. We have been walking. Oh my god, it's been a day of nothing but walking. But the views are so nice. Hi. And uh, we're so tired now. We're gonna head back to the hotel. Um, I think right here is like the main sites and attractions you see here in Melaka. There are other sites, but oh, look at the boat coming. There are other sites to see, but I don't think I'm gonna be doing all that because we are leaving tomorrow. We're leaving here for one full day. So yeah, I just wanted to catch you guys up on what we're doing. We're gonna go back to the hotel now to just relax, have a shower, and then possibly come out again tomorrow eve um, come out again later in the evening, like when it's dark, if not until tomorrow. But yeah, that is what we're up to now. Super tired. This coconut shake though, this is like the second one I'm I'm having. So good. Mmm, so good. Anyways, that's what we're up to. Bye. Good morning, guys. It's the next day in Melaka, and we are ready to check out. Suitcases packed. 
we're just here we just came here for only two nights it was very fun um there's really nothing much to see here but what's here to see is actually still fun like the um chinatown the walking streets the dutch square it's very beautiful very aesthetic uh, i would recommend if you're ever in malaysia and you're in kl kuala lumpur it's only like two hours from kl you can even make a day trip out of it if, if it's something you you want to do so yeah um we're ready to head back now we're going back to my brother's uh, Malacca was really fun. I really really had a good time and thank you guys for coming along with me We're gonna go check out take a bus back home and yeah, see you guys Bye Good morning guys, I am back in Kale as you guys can see I will, I've been back for like three days now, but I really didn't vlog because I didn't really do anything much besides just hanging out with my friends and just chilling. I know this vlog has been like up and down. That's to tell you that this trip was somewhat planned, but in the middle, it kind of went on its own way. But anyways, I am going back to Vietnam today. I'm going back to Hanoi. I've been so like anxious to go back because I, I plan to be here for two weeks, but then it extended to three weeks because of um, reasons that were beyond my control and the last one week i was here i was like so very antsy wanted to go back home wanted to go back to my routine work car scene and now that it's that i'm leaving today i'm just like i don't want to go i really really love kale i mean i went to like my whole trip here i was in kale and then i went to malacca which is just a, um like an hour two hours out of kale but i have to say kuala Lumpur is beautiful i enjoyed my time here and of course the fact that i know someone here made it even more fun because you know they could take me around i've been telling carson the whole time i can 100 percent see myself living here even the next couple years i come and tell you that we're moving to malaysia don't be surprised this trip did it for me you know you know I've, you know people always say you know they go to a place and they just fall in love with the place i don't think that has ever really happened to me until i came here like I'm so in love with the city. It's so beautiful. There's so much to do. And I know I'll definitely be back because I didn't even go to like so many places. I want to come back and go to Penang, Langkawi, and all the like beautiful islands here in Malaysia. So this is not the last time Malaysia will be seeing me. I will be back. I'm already planning the next trip in my head. But yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I know it was a little bit all around. Honestly, I, I, I've not started editing at this point, so I don't even know how long or short the vlog is. But however it is, I hope you guys enjoyed it anyways. Back to back to Vietnam, back to work tomorrow. I've been off work for three weeks now. But yeah, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me, exploring Malaysia with me. And I will see you guys in Vietnam. I'll see you guys in Hanoi. Bye guys.